house. Peppa and her family are visiting Madame Gazelle. Hello, Madame Gazelle. I saw you coming and I started dialing 911. Whoa! 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 Your hallway is a big slide, Madame Gazelle. What is this? A bottomless pit. <laughs> Shake it, George. Don't break it. <laughs> Is it meant to be like? Oh, no. These clods just touched me. I have coronavirus. What? No, the house is just old. Everything here is a little bit wonky donkey. Ow. You're wonky donkey. Not my house. Get out. When did your house start leaning, Madam Gazelle? Oh, I don't know. It's been so long. I'm going to act like I'm a teenager. And now I have cracks everywhere, too. Hmm. Ha ha. I'm smarter than you. I can say my ABCs. Look, my ABCs. Keep it together. Maybe changing the subject will help. Can't I just paper over the cracks and paint it? That is what my builder told me to do. I want to be a backyard again. Take me to your backyard. Ah, what's this? Oh, that is my little Christmas tree. That's not just any tree. That tree is from Team Trees. It was from Christmas a long time ago. It was a little baby tree with coronavirus on top. I'm gonna make this coronavirus look like a fairy. After Christmas, I could not bear to throw it away. So I planted it in the garden. Your baby tree looks fat now, just like me. Oh my goodness, obesity twins. That's a normal tree. It's not actually obese. You literally have the IQ of a house plant. Oh dear, what can we do about it? I'll call Mr. Bull. Okay, you can do this. Just say hello and hang up. Hello? So, where's this tree then? Do you have coronavirus? That's a mighty fine tree you have there, Madam Gazelle. Strong roots. I bet they felt that earthquake in China. Looks like I'm not the only obese one anymore. In your face, internet people that made fun of my obesity. Oh, yes. Let's chop it down. Oh, dear. My poor tree. Stop! Can't destroy I anything without me. The... What are you looking at? You're supposed to be listening to me. The little animal. Little girl, there are more important things than you. Before Mr. Bull chops the tree down, he must check that no animals are living in it. Tell me, bird child, why is your whole face a beak and an eye? Aha! Mr. Bull has found a bird's nest. Look at that! Little birdies nesting in your tree, Madam Gazelle! Whether they're birds or not, a pig always flies better. Like they say, when a pig flies. Okay, Peppa. We get that you don't understand simple science. Ooh, lovely birdies. I think there's something else higher up the tree. Look what's here. <laughs> Let's see what else there is. The exact opposite of Daddy Pig. Wise, not ugly. Um, wise. <gasps> I'm the only ugly beast that gets to insult Daddy Pig. Editor, end this video. There are about to be some cringe-worthy roasts.